Well, as you can see very clearly, it's a transparent display. So we're showcasing a transparent proof of concept. It's a display that allows you to interact with the real world versus just looking at screen so I can bring in objects from behind. The exciting thing is it helps unlock new use cases. And so, especially as you think about AI and the capabilities and how we interact with devices, this is changing completely. So now we want to bring in that augmented reality, digital overlay of the actual, of the real world. And the transparent display facilitates this. So the thing I love about this is the super bright panel. It's a 1,000 nit panel, so I can use it outdoor, anywhere. And then the, the transparent display allows me to interact with the device in new ways. So let's say I'm a designer and I want to design the next bridge across a river. I can go out into the field, actually look at the river and design on screen. This, this device supports pen, so I could bring a, a digital stylus and interact in one-to-one -one ratio. So I actually design it physically in the environment. All the new platforms we're, we're actually physically or announcing and launching um, here at MWC are AI uh, capable devices. So they have these new core ultra platforms that have a new engine um, on board, a, a neural processor that is adjacent to the CPU and GPU capabilities. That allows us to bring content that was up in the cloud or you know, online down local to the device. So it takes away some of the, the, the latency or speed of, of getting return, running local. I also take away some of the security privacy concerns that, that uh, some of the customers have in market.